2017. I like the way you've done that. Hello everybody and welcome to uh, uh, another game of Blood Bowl. Tonight we have Pender's first introduction to uh, multiplayer Blood Bowl online. He's had a fair few games offline so it's time to get him in the thick of some online play. Um, testing out the new live streaming feature so if, uh, if shit goes a bit tits up here please forgive me. Um, so from here we're, uh, we're going to get this match started. Ender, can you hear me, dude? I can hear you, aye. Nice one. And... Just going to switch to game view now. Get my team. Who we're playing against? Hello, everybody. Playing the Rim Jaws. Hardcore uh, Orc team. Hell yeah. Oh, I've just realised I'm coming through the stream twice. One sec. Oh, fuck. It's because I had YouTube written on the other window. See? Practice things for. Okay, so I just need to find you and then send you a challenge and I'm good to go. Okay, so we've got the Snog Bags versus the Rim Jaws. 16 turns, 4 minutes ago. Give me a bit of thinking time. Challenge sent. Challenge accepted. Here we go. Also, for those at home watching this, uh, testing instant replay feature tonight should be interesting. Uh, my team's took a slight bat run here. Um, I'm 1270 versus Henda's fresh team, so Henda's got 270k to spend on some interesting inducements. So, Pender's now picking his inducements. Meantime, I'll just be uh, giving him some time to mull over. Apologies if I sound like I'm underwater tonight. My nose is bunged up and I'm full of cold. Always a treat. Hopefully, if this uh, if this setup for the Blood Bowl matches is enjoyed by all, I'll probably set up more matches this way. I stream them live to YouTube. This particular match is live as it happens. Um, it can be pre-recorded if I want to do, but this one's actually live. And then it means any live streams that are recorded to YouTube get saved for future viewing. Also, as well as the uh, instant replay feature that I've put on here. I'm also going to be adding highlight reels to the ends of these live streams. So if awesome stuff happens, then I can just put shortcut links on the video. So you can fast forward or rewind to the cool bits. Okay, so Henda's decided to take a mercenary. And he's picked two kegs of blood wiser babes. Blood wiser babes. Got uh, Rumble talking to me here, who's also pointed out that my team's called the Snog Bags. Well, they're supposed to be called the Snog Bags, but I'm still a fucking typo, so they were called the Snog Bags. And he's mocking the fact that I'm full of cold at the minute. So they're the Snog Bags tonight. Okay. This match is not bought to a part and parcel at all by Rock Paper Shotgun. But I'm a regular member on the Rock Paper Shotgun football scene. So, yeah. Goblins versus Orcs. He won the toss and he's chose me to kick. 
So, let's take a look at Charles over here. Charles and Bobbins behind them. Yeah, this this was quite a good team at one point, and then uh, I had a poor go with plus one strength and block, and then my friend friends has fouled him into being absolutely useless. A chainsaw guy tripped over his chainsaw despite having plus one agility and died. And my fanatic uh, tried to go for it an extra square, wrapped the chain around his neck, and was minus one strength. So. All in all, this team got a pretty unlucky record, such as the life of a goblin team. Alright, well, that's a pretty generic looking goblin setup for me. Let's stop now that hand is tough. See, oh, that's about it. Left the pitch. Let's see some of these uh, interesting names. We've got the Klingon, Bollock Drop, Wet Fart, Brave Fart. Haha, <laughs> Brave Fart, I like that. Ooh, he's got a Black Orc hired gun, I think, with multiple block. Good choice for taking on goblins. Uh, Rimmer. Yuck it. The, the Trollop with one L. Rotten Fart. Rusty Bullet. I think Brave Fart is probably my favourite. Alright, let's make a kick. Hopefully, this will be a good kick. Whee! High kick. Well. Means that he gets a chance to stick one of his players under the ball. It was quite a good kick. Takes his thrower there. His thrower fumbles the ball. That worked out quite nicely. And the match begins. Turn one. I think it's just pointed out there that I can press G to assist users counting up squares, etc. Quite nice. I'm gonna have these uh I'm gonna have these tackle zones run, but I think they'll disappear when it's my turn, I could be wrong. Unless there's another shortcut that uh that could help me out with in order to hide these things up. That's what ends for. Ends for names. Okay. Anyway, that's a nice tip from Mumble there. Just means I can remember to press G now and again when there's a crucial situation or when I'm explaining stuff so that can help plan out the squares in between things. Oof. Okay now, 3 plus followed by a 3 plus. Unlucky there, dude. Unlucky, well, that threw me a little bit of a lifeline. And I feel like I pick up the ball there, instantly ending his turn. So let's see if I can capitalise on this with a bit of not a goodness. Oh shit, I've just realised I've got block. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. That's twice there, I could have took down both these players. What a twat. Ah. Yep, I could have took down both his black orcs there. It's been a while since I played this team. I forgot that my fanatic got block. Oh! Ah, uh, I was reading it backwards. It has been a few days. Oh shit! Double skulls on a troll. No. Right, let's see what. Come on, on the reroll. Oh fuck! Oh well. Yeah. Yep. That was a turnover. Oh, not a good start of the game here, people. Not a good start of the game at all. We got about two blocks. And get the double skills on a troll. Oof, defend that down. 
On the plus side tonight, I don't know about you guys, but I got some Newcastle brown ale. Always a treat. It's only because Bugman's doesn't deliver. Well, when I say deliver, I mean in the sense of delivering beer to the house. And he picks the ball up this time. Curious if he's going to throw it or not, but seemingly not. Maybe I can uh, spread it again. Yeah. Piling around the fanatic. Could be a good idea, could be a bad idea. That looks too edge strength seven. Plus this one's got block, which is a bit of a badass. Oh! Skulls! Bad roll. Seems all the bad rolls are coming out today. Coming for the blitz. It's a chainsaw. Oh, both down. Oh, oh, oh! He's dead. He is dead. Oh my word! That is fucking awesome. And this is why you play blood bowl, people. You've just used just as a warning, dude. You've just used your apothecary on a loner. Shit, eh? Fuck. <laughs> yeah, you need to watch out for that one, dude. Just as a, uh, just for the viewers at home, by the way, people, Henda is actually playing on his girlfriend's computer, which is the reason why you'll see the word princess pop up over here on the screen. That isn't actually because Henda's a princess, it's because he's playing on someone else's machine. Wow, what a start to a game. Was not expecting that. Oh, Mr. I Mr. That. Mr. Chainsaw Man has earned his keep. So then, what we got now? What do we have now? That looks swings wildly there. That looks swings wildly again. Let's see, come on Mr. Fnatic. One more time, on a go for it. Again. Fnatic managed to miss five times in a row there. Going for it twice, a bit risky business. In the name of the troll. Troll defender stumbles, doesn't mess around. A follow up. Oh! Wow, what is going on here? <laughs> Fucking trolls not messing around the day. Goblin's just gonna follow up the line there just to make sure everything sensible is going down. Wow. Two hits, two serious injuries. By me. This is a turn for the books. I'll bring the poor boy up slightly. Use this gobble as well. Get this gobble with plus one agility. We do a two white dice block. Nice. Defender stumbles. From there. Oof! Blimey. Only one off a, one off a serious injury. That was nearly a serious injury there, and I looking at the scores. Five and four. Blimey. Let's not push me luck too much. Uh, I'll move, move this gobble around here. Oh, there we go. Exactly what I was saying. Push my luck too much. Try to dodge. Fails. A bit of hand off. I've just realised there we've actually had two jaw-droppingly astounding bits of uh, bits of injuries, and I forgot to use the instant replay feature. Damn! And I bring his throw up the line. I'm gonna have to bring my trolls down this side. I've had got goblin backups, but still I'm starting to make quite a heavy a heavy presence on this side of the pitch. We've got Rusty Bullet. 
Coming over the wing now, seeing as uh, my rubbig is diving tackle, out for two. Blitz with the goblin, really? Goes down the blitz with a is that a blitzer? Yep. That's unlucky. Two defender stumbles, but again I've got dodge. Hmm. Starting to mark me up now. Area here is going to turn into quite a situation. This goblin up here, so get a little assist in. See what the fanatic can bring. Let's take him towards the ball. The fanatic there using his blocking skills. Oh, nicely placed fanatic there. Okay, let's see what backup we can get. Troll, oh, defender stumbles. Very nice, very nice troll action today. Didn't break the armor, but I'll settle for a non very stupid roll. Push back. I don't think we need to follow up there. Gobble goes in, gets the defender down. Very nice. Needed that. Well, uh, yes, I'll follow up. We can get the armor break. Hmm. Bit of a risky one, this. Just for those at home, we've just had someone join our Mumble channel. I'm just going to quickly send them the link. The situation here where I've got to do a one dice. Yeah, no other way around it, pretty much. Oh, nice! Defender down. Exactly what I needed. Oh, what the fuck? What, what the fuck? Let's see an instant replay on that. All those viewers at home. Fucking hell. Bit naughty that dude, bit naughty. Bit naughty. Blimey, so, I'm gonna go for the blitz here against this rusty bullet blitzer. See where we'll go from here. Hopefully that instant replay work for everybody at home. We got a push back, I'll take that. And uh, not the follow up. And we will head. Towards that little ball carrier. Is that you playing with goblins, Colin? Yep, playing with goblins. Um, doing unbelievably well. He hit my chainsaw guy and it killed his guy outright, so he used the dock on him. My next hit was with a troll, who caused another serious injury and then just had another one there, so. Yep. Uh, okay. I think, let's, let's try a little bit of sneaky shit. Let's pile in the boots. Oh! Oh! There comes the boot! Switch the instant replay there. Blimey. Yep, he's not going to have many players left at this rate. 
This is some serious goblin damage. I don't think I've ever seen a goblin team dish out so much damage in so little time. Three serious injuries and a death in, in, in three turns. That is pretty spectacular. Oh, there are many options, y'all, eh? And I is drastically running out of options here. Perhaps a bit of a uh, bit of a silly move there, moving this guy up. We'll see. He's talking to Rumble here in the in my side window. He sent me a message saying, "Are you seeing this?" You can probably get familiar with. Oh, what on earth was that? What on earth was that? I think that was a, a move of desperation there, Hender. Blimey. And I just threw the ball away there. I'm not quite sure what that, that was, was about. Definitely desperate, like. Triple dice on the thrower with the Fnatic. Let's see if we can throw him off the pitch. Oh, we got him off the pitch! Ha 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 This was not going well. This was not a very good day for Blood Bowl and Hemba. Blimey. Mind you, it's Blood Bowl, it can all change. Unbelievable rolls here. Unbelievable rolls. I'm counting my lucky stars here. Same dude, I am certainly counting my lucky stars here. Okay, Rubik's back up in the action. Needs to go for the square, nice. He can protect the troll now. Speaking of which, troll nicely shimmying him up the line there. Here's your round playing with Billy Goblins. My, old, my team looks like yours, does any? Get Shag. Gitchag? Is that really his name? His name is no, Gitchag. Campaign mode. <laughs> really? That's, that's uh, some interesting generated name. Oh, come on. Yes. Push him towards a fanatic. Follow up. Charles Mighty Blow there, coming in useful. Now then, dive and tackle. Let's stick some dive and tackle beside this guy. With the trollop. Make it difficult for him to get to that ball. In the meantime, we will get got a pogo up the line, seeing as this is a fresh pogo line, I'd rather we have him start play our points to his aim, see if we can get him to score a goal. Pitch now. And let's, let's just lay the boot in. Lay the boot in, see what we can get. Come on! Oh, nice done there, armor break. Nicely done, nobody sent off. Oh, what a hander. Oh no, bringing out a blitz with a blitzer. Eh? Rusty bullet. Who's he going for? It's going for the Pogo, huh? Oh, going for it, failure. Oh, yeah. Taking it down, though. Knockout. Well, it looks like he won't be scoring a touchdown this half. Follows up as well. There's a nice dodge there, despite me having dive and tackle. It was a critical success, which is why the dive and tackle wasn't triggered. And he picks up the ball. He's in a bit of a shitty situation now, though, because he's got no one to throw the ball to. By the way, if you uh, do happen to enjoy these, or if you've got any constructive feedback, such as anything like not, anything not like you're a fucking arsehole or stuff like that, but if you've got constructive criticism, we're more than happy to listen to it. Please enjoy these little videos, I'll be making some more. I'm just going to follow up there. 
Hmm. Have to do a blitz with a troll, but bring the fanatic up into the game first. Gonna blitz on. Come on, Mr. Troll. You can do it. I believe. Yeah. Two. Not gonna knock him up a square. Just gonna knock him. Oh, shit. Alright. Cheats not too bad. Not too bad. Oops, yeah. Give the white dice. We can get us all out of the way. Get that ball in mid possession. Yes, again, defender down. I can't complain with these rolls. It's been very good this game. Especially on the injuries. Let's go here with uh, this one agility. I think. Order of the day is just to, uh, just to block them. Let's say block them, I mean obstruct them. Let's see if we can lay some feet into Rusty Bullock here, see what happens. Come on. Failure. I'm amazed I haven't been sent off yet. Count my lucky stars here. Rusty Bullock stands up. That was a wise move. Ball and chain dude. The reason why I called him ball and chain dude is because when you get bribes, it can be quite a pain in the arse to work out which player is the person who you're rescuing from a bribe, especially the top teams, which is why it's, this is called Chainsaw Dude the second. See, it's called the second because my first fucking guy died. What on earth does he do? What on earth does he do? Really? Really? Oh, let's see that again on the instant replay. Oh, my word. You can see he went for a double dodge there for the blitz. Didn't work at all. Blimey, and a turnover. Well, I know you're going to have no one left by the end of this match, dude. Fuck you now. Maybe I shouldn't have took that risk, like. <laughs> no, I know there's a risk for a biscuit, but that was a fucking biscuit and a half. Oh! What is going on with these fucking oh, dice rolls? Unfucking real, especially for goblins. Oof, I'm a break as well. You know what you get here. Come on! No! Get him! No! This time! No! Ah, well. Useless as ever, fanatic. Oh shit's gonna go wrong. There's a reroll here. Oh no! Four dice! Turnover! Not good. Not good. Not good at all. Ah, the turnover ends just like that. Just perhaps throwing them a little lifeline. You can scrap to get the ball out of my hands. Perhaps. Need to think wisely here, Hendo. The fact that the Fnatic having strength 7 is going to make it very difficult. He's going to have to do a dodge if he wants to get out of there. It's quite simply, you don't want to be doing double red dice on a Fnatic that has block. None of that shit ever ended well. The only other way he could get in there is if he does a dodge blitz. There we go, a blitz there. What is he going to do? I think this time. Oh, dive and tackle. Oh, and he passes the dive and tackle. Oh, and he gets a defender down. Nice roll. Very nice roll. I 
Good sidestep though. Desperate. Sidestep with the troll. Hopefully he won't follow up. Oh, he does follow up and he knocks my guy out. Ah! Caught by a goblin! What is the chances of that? <laughs> he gets the knockout. That's a win. Goblin catches it. That's a loss. Unlucky dude. Sure. To be honest, just need to get this orc out of the way. Nobody be good to go. Snilloop. Hasn't scored any star player points yet. Dodge him with a black orc. Risky business. Fanatic. Come on, you fanatic. What actually happens with a fanatic at the edge of the pitch if he goes off the pitch here? Hmm, interesting. Has anybody ever seen that? Answers on a postcard. If the fanatic inaccurately goes off the pitch. So, let's leave these over here. Nice! Uh, I was actually supposed to put a goblin there to help troll with this very stupid roll and completely forgot. Well, that worked out nicely. I'm going to the dive and tackle goblin there. I would rather have one person on six than two people on three, so I'm going to hand the ball off. I'm just going to catch Catches the ball, nicely done. Uh, I'll do it now. It's gonna have to do a dodge here if he wants to knock the ball out of my hands, and I've got a dive and tackle on ice. What is he gonna do? Instant replay, which I think I was a bit too late on. But well, fucking hell. Well, that's a first. Never ever seen that happen before. And it's half time! It's half time! Fuck! Cost us the fucking touchdown! Fuck! Well, I think I'm doing pretty good now, though. Eh? <laughs> Fuck! Fuck, fuck, time. fuck, I don't it's believe it. Must be a fucking touchdown. What a twat. Man, you, he's not exactly in good shape. Ah. Damn. This has certainly been an interesting game to watch. Oh, yeah. to players. Just got a ha-ha from there. From Rumble. Over, over Steam. One of the Rumbles watching this via the stream is uh, talking to me via Steam. Can you imagine it being like a... 
Nelson. Nelson's came up. Okay. Let's see it hit that. Looks pretty awesome. When you talk around the street, you see a princess pop up on the side. Where's my plus one is ready to go? Alex, really, I want to be a girl. Get up. Alrighty then. Okay, dude, give us a kick. Give <sighs> a bitch, eh? Ball will land off field. Nice, I do like it when that happens. And I get another one up here, there's one square. Very nice. Can't make it now. I'm gonna shimmy this way. Get a, get a char char slide up over it. Okay then, balls off the field. Try this again, Mr. Pogo man. Try not to get knocked out this time. Trolls are doing very good today. Haven't failed a single very stupid roll. I'm amazed. Uh, follow up. Oh, follow up. Uh, and then you say shit like that and fucking. Uh, jinx myself, totally deserve it. Well, not what I'd hope for. Running decidedly short on beer here. Not good at all. I'm gonna have to uh, get another one out of the fridge. I tried a fabric. I've got no, got no bottle opener. My bottle opener's downstairs. I can be asked to get it. Trying to fabric the bottle opener using the ultimate survival tool, a la Bear Grylls knife. Um, however, I ended up cutting my finger and not opening the bottle of beer. So I resorted to a less deadly spoon. So, yeah. You want to open a beer? Don't open it. Don't use a knife. Use a spoon. Oh, gets a boat down there. I've got mighty blow arm block. How the hell have I got mighty blow block? Ah, yes, it's because he's attacking the troll with block. Very nice. <laughs> Unlucky here. He's getting two right dice, and uh, get the defender stumbles. But I've got dodge, and he's got block. Just a bit of a pain in the ass for him. Not that I'm complaining. On the subject of Bear Grylls now, by the way. This is probably about as Bear Grylls as I get, I'm afraid. Is it like a Bear Grylls barbecue? Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's probably the limitations of my uh, survival instinct.
It's all getting a bit traffic jammed here and I don't like it. Mm. Come on. Nice. Blackwalks out the way. Very nice rules again. I'm fucking loving this. I don't think I've ever had rules like this in a problem team before. Charles got guard, which I like, so I'm going to move him up here so he can't assist against him. Get a one down stuff here. And then start throwing people into the crowds. Shit, that was meant to be a blitz. Fucking double twitched my finger. God damn it. Again! Oh Fucking hell! Let's see that again for those at home watching on the street. Blimey. Knocks him straight down. No nonsense. Serious injury. Kapow. Uh, well, where to go from here? Let's see if we can one dice this guy. Let's, let's, let's be a little bit cocky. Let's push him back a bit. Get over there, you bitch. Let this turn over. I can't believe I fucking lost the touchdown in the first half. That was a bloody fanatic throwing himself off the pitch. It's, it's, it's like, it's like I'm pleased to use a witness in this because certain things. Ha Blood Bowl is known for the nuffle. An example of nuffle is uh, I say things like, oh! Look at my trolls, aren't they wonderful? No very stupid rules. And then you instantly fail a very stupid rule. And things like, Ah, oh, I've never seen a fanatic go off the edge of the pitch. Fanatic goes off the edge of the pitch and absolutely cripples himself. Having said that, or as much as I'm bitching, that is possibly the best serious injury result I've ever seen on a goblin team. So, I'll go again. Let's go for a blitz. Is it going to be a rusty bullet? Or is it going to be you? Who is it? It's making the dodge, it's failed. One dice out, and he gets a push back. I think my aim here is just simply get as many players off, off the pitch as possible. And then go. That's a good plan. There's been very. Some very good plans in Blood Bowl, not, be, not made by me. Keep my plans as simple as get them off the pitch and then score. Feels a uh, dodge there. Rusty Bullock tripped you over. Oh! Double defender down. What is going on with these rolls, dude? Seriously, fucking. Stupid risks that I shouldn't even be doing. <laughs> you are being very risky, I must say. Oh, come on, come on, the troll. Alright, yeah, let's just start throwing people off the pitch. Come on, off the pitch. Off the pitch. I insist. <laughs> Let's 
aussi pour un de parquet. He's just trying to move this guy in towards. He's going to jam between the trolls. It's a nice place to be. Shit. Probably shouldn't have pushed him there now. Got to make a dodge. Job probably fail. Please don't fail. Please don't fail. Please don't fail. Don't fail. Ooh. Oh, he's just fucking with us there. I did fail, but thanks to the skin on my balls. I, uh, yeah. Move one of my one of my diving ticklers up here to try and block the way. Ooh, I just thought that troll was going to have nobody babysitting them. So I'll just put him there. I can't believe I've got five rerolls and I haven't used a single one. That's outrageous, especially on turn 11 as well. Grabek Break T, or oh, is the loner? He died. Yes, he was the guy that famously died to the hands of the uh, the chainsaw guy. Very nicely done. But then Panda decided that he would rather sacrifice the doc than have the extra man. Which I think, to be honest, actually, when it when he's badly hurt and things, wasn't actually a bad call. Is the fact he's alone not going to cost him though? Nope, it isn't. A nice defender down there. That was a straight up slap in the dish. Again. It's Sod's law, mind you, that he, he would get the serious injury on uh, with his Lorna, so that he doesn't actually get the star player points for it. You've been, you've been very unlucky with these injuries, Hender. You've actually only had two injuries so far, and they've both been caused by the Black Orc. That's a Lorna. And you're not going to take those four star player points away with you after this game. Just in case you are wondering why I occasionally shift and glance to the left and the right. I have a triple monitor set up here. Triple twin sets Um on the middle monitor is obviously my game. On my right hand monitor is my OBS live stream. Uh, and on my left hand monitor I've just got a collaboration of shit. I've got my mumble channel, I've got my chat window with Rumble. My Steam friends list, I've got the YouTube stream status, uh, I've got YouPorn, Razaz, Past the Couch, the few other windows all on, on this screen. But, but excuse me if I shift me look from the left to the right, more this way, what the screen's got on it. Troll comes in there, nice defender stumbles. I just realised, belly stench. This troll's actually levelled up off this game. Awesome. Oh fuck, I just realised, yes. <coughs> I didn't stand a goblin next to him, so I am now up shit creek. And he's got guard, but I can no longer use it because he failed his fucking stupid roll tits. There goes the pogo again. Let's go for the touchline. Uh, 
Let's move this guy up here. This guy up here. Nice little dodge. Come on, let's see if we can take this big Black Hawk down. That's not a racist sen sentence. And that's not like Black Hawk down. I'm confused Black Hawk down with Black Hawk down. Oh, we can get this Black Hawk down. Oh, no, 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 no. It's not what we need. Come on, reroll. That'll do. Black Hawk down. Yeah, not for long, though. Okay, yeah, let's see what I can get him out of here. Got two trolls down there, which are a little bit mean. I'm too bothered though, because I've got the ball in quite a safe position. Up a little bit there. Not enough players. I don't think it's going to do much good. He needs to be breaking it down. I think he's at the minute. At a stage at the minute where he's just kind of. don't know what to do. Oh, damn you, very stupid troll. Oh, what on earth? What on earth? And by them, them dodges are very risky. You don't know that was a dodge on a minus two, so you needed a six. You're dodging through two tackle zones there. This good business. But, uh, let's just get the fuck away from there. I don't like any of that shit. It's going down. Uh, we need to get. We do need to get these black orcs out of the way. I'll do. Black orc down. Again. Nobody. That's available to try and stop. Yeah, that's what I've just said over the comment group before that. Uh, we're in a bit of a situation at the minute. Cool. When this guy's down, gets the trolls back in the action. Let's get block. He doesn't have block. Let's go. Trolls. Outrageously fucking good. Outrageously good rules, that is. Not to be confused with outrageously good. Still, pretty good rules this game. Stick him over there. Um, be a pain in the arse, but we'll then move him over there. Shit, foul. And that's very much on the chase now. He needs to get me, uh, needs to get some of these little bastard gobblers out of the way. He actually hasn't had a chance to use that multiple block all game as well, which is a bit of a shame. I think instead of picking multiple blocks, we should just put normal block. But yeah, like I said earlier on, if you like these videos, feel free to subscribe, feel free just to stick a comment on this one, say yeah, say your video's shit, or your video's good, or you forgot to mention this, or you should have mentioned that, or I don't like your camera angle, or I don't like your burglars hoodie, or I think you're a dick, or you've got a voice that's anything to or whatever you do, I'd probably appreciate a little bit of feedback, rather than more feedback. If he's, if he's like Blood Bowl, oh no, what we got, nope, bad thing here. If he's like these Blood Bowl videos, thanks for the uh, for those at the bottom. I do play Blood Bowl quite regularly with my friends, Frenzers and Bumble. So you'll probably see some of our games with some of our veteran teams. And well, they're probably not suitable if you're uh, sent to the bad language. Get quite carried away. Oh fuck. Ah oh, bollocks! Oh no. 
Oh no, this is where it all goes tips up. This is where I, I lurk on the sidelines like some little bitch. God damn it. You can't catch me for another turn. Oh! Oh yeah, he's got blocked. Little bastard. Getting some more information here from the press and see change camera angle, sorry about that. I just actually read the message off him first and then I decided to test it out. Uh, I can confirm that he wasn't lying. Oh, let's try this again. I fucking failed a very stupid roll again. Oh, this touchdown will be on you. Oh, get me money's worth, yeah? Ah, uh, that sounds like you. <laughs> Bleeding that shit dry. Let's go. Another, another disco dance from here. I know Hand up won't appreciate it at all. He's gone for skill points now, are not he? Another foot smack. Smack the ball. Touchdown! Yeah, it wasn't really a well earned one, I'm afraid. It's quite shameless, but when, when you're playing as a goblin coach, to be honest, you take what you get. And a little rat. Kind of like a little clockwork, windy up rat. This team will be very sorry for himself. I don't think I've ever seen so many injuries on an orc team when facing goblins before today. I don't know what the fuck happened there. Camera went all spazzy. Right. Who's got the least amount of star player points? Because you are going on the front line. Two star player points? Two star player, star player points, that puts you at the front line, so. Alright. Fucking Bogoa. And we need one more level up, little bastard. Here we go, dude. And the camera resets itself again. Yeah, actually, also, I'll throw, I'll throw a little uh, a little pin to the RPS with the league. Rock, paper, shotgun. Rock, shotgun. Yeah, yeah. Try it again. Rock, paper, shotgun .com have a Blood Bowl league. Uh, they have several Blood Bowl leagues, actually, which I'm a part of. Oh, perfect defense. You'll not be happy about that. You'll not be happy about that at all. Um. So yeah, they have an ongoing league. Oh, what a kick! That was a fucking awesome kick. But uh, yeah, they, they have some ongoing leagues. I'm sure if anybody's interested, get yourself along, join in. Yeah, they all seem quite friendly people. Played with them for a fair few seasons now. Oh my god, what, what on earth? What on earth? I think he's just given up. He's going for all of I, I think, I think that was, that was de definitely an all or nothing. Um, that's actually an interesting concept. It's my turn 16 here. Let's try an all or nothing. Let's see if we can throw this goblin right the way up the pitch. Come on. He throws him. Uh, a partial success. Uh, yeah, he's got a guy there with, with Lona in multiple block. That's like having a bullseye on your head for fouling. So. In comes the stampsies. Didn't so much as take them. Well, 
Can we give that and throw another go? The <laughs> wise choice. Bats. No rerolls. Not a lot you can do. Guess it's gonna go for that throw. But that throw is probably the only thing you can do. Get the ball. Run it down. There we go. Gonna make a quick pass. Minus two that lad on the catch. Good game, dude. Oh, okay. so oh. Last night, I'm lucky I got away with just uh, one touchdown against us. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, uh, it was a bit scandalous for the Fnatic to throw himself off the pitch there. You want to re-roll your winnings? No, I think I'll be happy with that. 80 grand. Let's see what we get. Oh, I got one level up. Belly stench the troll. Let's see what he gets. Come on, the double. Oh! Double. Plus one armor value or plus one movement. Nice. It's gonna have to be block. I almost gave him plus one armor value, but no, it's gotta be block. Well, that now means I've got two trolls with block. That is tremendous. Could make them last a lot longer as well. Well, anyway, this is uh, Big C nine hundred two one zero from uh, TeamSEO.com and the No Blueprints blog. And uh, hopefully you've enjoyed this uh, game of Blood Bowl. Uh, if you have, please drop us a comment, like, or subscribe. And uh, thank you very much for watching.